Hi, my name's Charlie Anderson and I studied film studies last year. I did film studies at A-Lab. My name is Joe Eaton Ken. I studied film studies at Finham Sixth Form. I studied film production at Finham Park Sixth Form and it was the best decision I ever made. I thoroughly enjoyed the subject and it was 100% my favourite subject that I did at A-Level. So not only was the course very engaging and very practical, it also focused a lot on context and it helped me improve my essay writing skills which are essential for your further study. Film studies were my favourite subject. This was in large part due to the teaching quality of the course, but also to do with the course structure itself, which covered a variety of topics and allowed you to explore them all in great depth, which was fascinating. So it's a course that isn't only so much fun to be a part of because the teachers are very, very invested and they make the production side really really fun but also it's a course that gives you skills that you will need in your further study whatever you go on to doing. I think what made media stand out for me personally is the kind of difference in personality and uh, creativity you can put into the course. I think one of the things that makes film so good is the variety of learning and what you learn, the teaching style so um, Mr Gunn would never have you just sit down and copy notes. The key difference with film studies and any other subject I studied at A-Level it's the sheer depth of analysis and learning within the course. Some of the most important things I learned from the course, I'd say, first and foremost, would be keeping track of deadlines and sticking to what you said you were going to do. It's quite important in the sense that if you start falling behind when you said you were going to finish something, by like, it kind of gets a bit stressful. You do learn to have a lot more uh, better time constraints. Kind of, you know, it's all right to do your own thing, you know. It's kind of what sets you apart from everyone else. So looking amongst everyone's work, I saw that everyone, you know, was doing their own thing. It was great in all different kind of ways, aspects and everything else. One of the most important things the course taught me was how to put theoretical ideas into practice. This was learned from the coursework section, which required creating several different short films. <laughs> Mr Gunn was my teacher. He really insisted that we work our hardest to achieve the best results. He helped me to understand the beauty of recorded media and he created a love and a respect for it as well. Can you remember your dream? As other courses may have you doing a certain tech set task or you know, something like that for your coursework, whatever. While media kind of gives you a lot more freedom and creativity into making something that you actually want to kind of create yourself. It revolves around your interests, passions. Or... I got to learn all about how, you know, the film world works and as art imitates life, how, you know, how the world and how people work as well. So I've just gone on to uh, graduate from Rose Bruford College and I have just filmed for a uh, BBC series and I'm also writing my own scripts uh, for films which I hope to uh, put towards um, directors and producers to see if they can be made into films as well. I'm currently at university studying events management and I think that film is definitely one of the ways that helped me realise that it's definitely what I wanted to do um, through organising the film festival. The film festival is honestly, I think, one of the best things about film and media as a department. Um, it gives the filmmakers so many opportunities to meet industry professionals. I think sometimes if you're learning about a subject, you might often feel it's very theory based, um, but the good thing about film is it's very practical and you make the films and then you actually get them judged by celebrity judges. I know, um, one of my friends in the year above, she met someone there and from that she got a job out of it. So the opportunities there are absolutely endless. I'm currently at Gap here and will be attending university next year, but regardless of what you do after A level, film studies is still a great background for you. It's the skills you learn from it easily transfer up to any creative field. Some of the qualities you might need, I'd say, are good timekeeping and time management. Uh, another thing that we might need is creativity. So go into what you want to make not to something you're passionate about, something you really like to talk about or would like to show off to the world, for example. In order to succeed in film studies, the main quality you need is determination. This is particularly relevant in the practical side of the course, as your film will go wrong at some point. 
It's not an absolute requirement, I'd say, but at least a little bit of technical ability will also be the last requirement. If you've got any kind of skills in editing, music, anything like that, then it's fantastic to kind of boost you in the right direction, as it were. At the end of it, you'll find films that used to be one of the most rewarding courses there is. Liven up with joy. Don't forget, take your joy. Absolutely go into media if you're interested in it, even in the slightest. I'd recommend the course wholeheartedly for several reasons. The teaching quality is excellent, which makes you really want to motivate yourself to achieve well in the subject when you have a teacher pushing so hard for your success. So yeah, I definitely advise you doing film. I started off in year 12 working at an E-grade, and because I pursued it and I worked really hard, my coursework at the end of year 13 was an A. So if you put the effort in, you really can get like the best results. If you would like to go to a job in kind of filmmaking or any kind of game making, I so wholeheartedly recommend it. The stuff you learn is invaluable, it's a fantastic experience.